I really hate clowns. Okay, welcome everyone. Today, it, well, this video is not a iTunes Daily Report. This is a Doctor Who Client Mod Smart Entity System. Smart Entity. Friendly Smart Entity Feature Rundown. <clears throat> Apologize for that. Uh, but yeah, this uh, this is the start of a new series to put onto the threads of the Doctor Who Client Mod Smart Entities in the uh, iTunes SGC forums. To, for people who have a hard time reading big walls of texts. So I am going to be doing the reading the texts for you. <laughs> yeah. There's some people that are just so lazy they can't read it. But yeah. This video is about canine. Canine, occasionally styled canine with a dash, was the designation given to a series of intelligent dog-like robots who served as companions for the fourth doctor, Leia, Romana, Sarah Jane Smith, and Starkey in the canine Disney thing, which, yeah. <laughs> Features of this smart entity, companion smart entity, yes, this is different than fr friendly, hostile, neutral smart entities. This is a companion smart entity where you can control what they do or they interact with you in a lifelike manner. Although, all smart entities do that, so ignore that. But yeah, here's the features. Smart entity system. This is K9, uh, the K9 model in the game right now is K9 Mark IV. Yeah, Mark IV. The model, this mo uh, this, uh, this Mark of K9 was the one given to Sarah Jane Smith by the Doctor in two the 2006 episode, School Reunion with the Krillitanes and all that stuff. Uh... It also appeared in the Sarah Jane Adventures Seasons 1 through 5. Uh, this canine has a flight system. It can hover one block above the ground. It is integrated with the Jethric power system. Rechargeable by Jethric-enabled Sonic screwdriver. Not regular powered Sonic. Totally different. <laughs> it is. It has a maximum power mode, which is activated by... Je a Jethro crystal being installed in K9. Uh, its weapon system is the maximum defend defense mode. It has laser weapons supercharged by Jace Knight crystals, different from Jethro. Although one is a weapon system sort of thing, but not lethal like you would expect. And uh, more features about this K9 are in development, so I'm just going to give you a little show off of what he does. Here's maximum defense mode. Just gonna spawn a zombie. And he oh, well let's just spawn a uh weeping angel. So yeah I have waited until it got dark out just to show you maximum defense mode against a horde of zombies. Click 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 click. Ooh, coming after me, not canine. Ah K9 can also follow you using the custom smart entity pathfinding system by YoFreak. Wow, zombies are following me up the trees. Where'd, where'd K9 go? Uh oh. There he is. Attack, you metal tin dog. Oh yeah, let's end that. As you can see, it, he can take out oh, a huge huge amount of zombies and other hostile entities but let's end that and then spawn a new canine in a new world no nope, let's just go this way so yeah you can switch him from normal to maximum defense mode like that however this GUI will be getting a reimagining just so it has a prop it, it looks better like, I'll be changing the textures, maybe a little different things to it. But you can also put him on your head. You see? On your head. 
So yeah, I think that covers it for this canine video. Uh, more to come when the Jethric and Jace Knight systems are in-game. So yeah, that's the end of the first ever Doctor Who Client Mod Smart Entity System show feature so showcase episode one, blah blah. See you in the next one, or a daily report. Whatever comes first. Bye. Oh, www.doctorwho.icons.gc.com and www.dailyreport.icons.gc.com and I wonder how faster I can say those two URLs before I run out of breath.